everybody, it's iPod King Carter here, the Superman of YouTube, and I present to y'all the stat sheet stuffer. Yes, he's back for his season in the NBA 2K13 world. First of all, let me give a shout out to my boy Jalil Beast for providing a track that I could just simply speak over, get things out the way, it's nice, it's flowing. Let me get into it, y'all, but first of all, you already know how the game goes. In 2K13, you can't just simply create your player. You actually have to create a my player first. So what I had to do was, in order to keep both my my players, I had to go into the my player tab, get this guy, you know, studded out, changed his name and everything. And as soon as I got the look right, I decided to go into the 2K store, grab a couple things, cop up. I guess you guys can already see from here, I'm copping this New Orleans gear which means I'm going for the number one pick. Hey, I ain't got no fear in my heart. I'm gonna go into the rookie showcase one and done. See if I can get this number one draft pick. Hey, if I don't go number one, just guess what? I done spent all this cash, all this VC for nothing. But all I can say to you guys is, I got faith, man. Check my guy out with the bling on right now, snapback. You know I had to change it to the back, so I'm still repping at New Orleans. You, look at the KDs on my feet. You guys already know what the game's gonna be like. Now here, this is where I switched the game up. I actually have to go in the accessory shop to grab a couple straps. You know, I want to grab my Jordan calf sleeves. You know, I want to do a little things different. Make sure that my guy is fully equipped for the rookie showcase game. I wanted to make sure that he is fully prepared for you guys. Fully done, fully, you know what I'm saying? This is why I got all this VC. I've been saving up. I've been stacking, I've been racking playing blacktop, playing Facebook apps. I've been on my iPhone draining my battery for this VC, but I realized that the Jordan calf sleeves didn't come in different colors, so you know what I went, man. I had to get the power web calf sleeve. It's all good, man. As long as I got two of them things, one on each leg, we gonna do what it do. Also, you already know that the Under Armour, it's a must, man. I got I gotta get the Under Armour. It's, it's only right, you know, I gotta get the shorts, gotta get the top. And I'm going to make it through with it, dude. I know a lot of y'all probably like, man, he has so much VC. He's going to be a 99 as soon as he even starts his first game. This is what I want you guys to understand. Once I create my my player, I'm not going to put all of his attributes up. I'm actually going to be buying packages like dunk packages, shooting forms, layups, animations, pre-game rituals. Trust me, it's it's gonna be it's gonna be nice tight for y'all. I'm not gonna just make this dude 99 straight out the gate. You can expect greatness. Now, as we hop into the creation, I want you guys to stop this video. You know what I'm saying? Pause it real quick. Get your pen and pad. If you want to create this guy on your own, what you can do is follow all the steps. Everything's gonna be done to perfection, even a jump shot. But in my next video, that I'm gonna be updating real fast. I'm gonna be changing this jump shot. Of course, you guys already know I'm going to be buying dunk packages and pregame rituals. Um, and I guess you could say, now I just got to fight to get the number one pick, man. You know, I'm, I'm already repping the colors, man. You see the shoes? I got the yellow in the shoes. You know, I got the power web, calf sleeves. Ain't much more I could do, man. All I can say is when I go into the rookie showcase, I got to go in with a clear head. And I know you guys are probably asking, well, how is he going to get number one? I haven't seen many people do it. Well, I guess the trick to getting the number one spot is you got to get a triple double, you got to score over 30, and you got to get an A plus grade. Now, me personally, I think a triple double might be hard, seeing as though this is a scoring small forward. This is not an athletic small forward, so I won't be making it up and down the court fast. I don't know if I'm going to have enough stamina to even jump for a rebound. I know my passing game is going to be trash truck juice because I am a scorer. So getting a triple double will be hard. Now as it goes for the A+, I think I'm going to be able to get that. I'm going to set a few screens, take nice jump shots. Every time I try to score, I'm going to try to score on the double move. But this is me saving my guy. You know, I got to save it as a stat sheet stuffer. It's only right. Now what you're going to see here is when I save it, you're going to see two files. One is iPod King Carter and one is the stat sheet stuffer. If you guys want me to make a video on how I got two of my careers and two of my players on the same account, just let me know and I will make that video. But episode one is over. You know, it's NBA 2K13, baby. Let's get it. Peace.